worship you. Ancient of days, we worship you. The Lion of tribe of Judah, we worship you. The God who changed. Since your father was small, his people have hated him. The only child. Lord. They call the praises, Lord, for you are worthy of our thanks. You are worthy of our praises. Lord, we have come to say thank you. Lord, we worship your name. Lord, we magnify your name. Lord, we magnify your name. Lord, we worship your name. Lord, take all the glory. Lord, take all the honor. Lord, take all the adoration. We worship you, Lord, for another moment in your presence. We thank you, Lord. Thank for another Father. Monday in your presence. Thank you, name. ancient of days. Receive for the praise. Bible says, this is the day the Lord Receive has made that we rejoice and be glad in it. Lord, we are Father, grateful. We, thank you. we are grateful, Lord, Receive for your day. loving kindness. Receive we are grateful, Lord, for your we tender worship. mercies, we are grateful, Lord. We worship, we worship you because we you're worthy. We worship you because you you're kind. We worship you because you you're faithful. Be we worship you because you there is none Lord. like you. Thank you, thank Jesus, you, Jesus, for Lord. your preservation. Father, Lord, thank you, Lord, Lord for last today. week. Thank you, Lord, for the last month. Thank you, Lord, for all you have done. Father, we, we are grateful for another month, Lord. Lord. We, we are grateful for another it week, Lord. Another we are grateful, Lord, for another, another privilege, Father, for another opportunity to showcase your soul. goodness and your mercy. We worship you. We, we thank you, Lord. We, give we you thank you, glory. Jesus. You we are worship you, ancient of days. Take all the glory, Lord. Take all the honor, Lord. Take all the adoration. We say thank you. We say thank you. Father, we, we say thank you. Lord, we say thank you. We, we say thank you. We, we say thank you. You are ancient of days. Thank you, Father. We say thank you, thank you Jesus. mighty God. Jehovah, we we say praise. thank you, Jehovah, we incomparable we God. We say thank you, ocean divider. You we say thank you, our preserver. We, give you we say thank you, we our sustainer. We say thank you, 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 our sustainer. We say thank you. We worship you, Lord, for your mercy in our lives. We worship you, Lord, for your goodness in our lives. We worship you, Lord, for your tender mercy. We worship you, Lord, for who you are, for what you have done, for what you are doing, for what you are going thank to do. You, we thank, thank you, you Jesus. for there is no like you. We thank Jehovah you we because you are mighty. Your we thank you. Jehovah we we worship you. For your Take all the glory. Father, we Take all the honor. For your Lord. Take all the adoration. Take you. all the praises. Take all the thanksgiving. We worship you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. 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 You. Thank you, Lord, Jesus, for what we are doing we in our lives. You. Thank for you, Lord, you because we can you see your goodness. You we can see old. your mercies. You we say old. thank God the glory, Lord. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. We are going to ask God to forgive us if there be any sin in any area we have sinned against him. The careless words of our mouth. I came to realize something more serious. I know it before. Something I knew before. But recently, during our fasting, the Lord brought it back to me and, you know, was talking to me about it. That thing is a sin of careless words. The mistakes of careless words. We are going to say, Father, forgive me from sin of careless words evil imagination of my heart. The Bible says, what do you imagine in your heart against the Lord thy God? You are going to say, Father, forgive me. Any evil imagination, any wrong imagination in my heart against the Lord, against my own self, against people around me. Every careless word that come out from our mouth we cause carelessly we make joke with wrong words. We're going to say, Father, 
let your mercy prevail. Forgive me. Open your mouth and begin to pray wherever you are. Open your mouth. Ask God for mercy. Lord, we ask for mercy. Lord, we ask for mercy. From careless words, we ask for mercy. From careless words of our mouth, we ask for mercy, Lord. Forgive us, O God. Forgive me, O God. From every careless word, the Bible says that every man shall give account of every idle words, every idle words that come out from my mouth, every idle words from my heart. Lord, I ask for mercy. 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 Let your mercy prevail. Let your mercy prevail. Jesus, let your mercy prevail. Jesus, forgive us, O God. Jesus, forgive us, O God. Jesus, cleanse us, O God. Jesus, look eyes of mercy on us. 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 Father, we confess the sin of careless words. Father, we confess the sin of careless talk. Every careless talk, every negative word, we ask for your mercy. We ask for your mercy. Are you praying where you are? Are you praying right where you are? Ask God for mercy. Ask God for mercy. Anything that will hinder God from sustaining you, let mercy prevail. Jesus, let mercy prevail. Jesus, let mercy prevail. Jesus, let mercy prevail. Jesus. Let mercy prevail. Jesus, let mercy prevail. Jesus, let mercy prevail. Jesus, let mercy prevail. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Let us begin to obtain mercy. I say, Father, by your mercy as I pray, let my prayers be answered. Let nothing stand as a hindrance. Lord, show me mercy now as I begin to pray. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Lord, show me mercy. Lord, show me mercy. I receive God's mercy. Receive that mercy. Receive that mercy. I receive God's mercy. I receive God's mercy. I receive God's mercy. I receive God's mercy. For my prayers to be answered. I receive God's mercy. Because I will not pray in vain. I receive God's mercy. Because I will not pray in vain. I receive God's mercy. Because heaven will not close over my prayer. 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 I declare that heaven over my prayers be open. Heaven over my prayers be open. I refuse to pray under closed heaven. I refuse to pray under closed heaven. I declare that heaven over my prayers. Let it be open. 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 Heaven over my prayers. Be open. In Jesus' name we pray. One more time. I welcome every one of you to let us pray with Chinosa Enable prayer platform. It's a platform for prayers. It's a platform where we dedicate our week into the hand of God for God to have his way and lead us. Because the Bible says, commit our ways into the hand of God and it will direct your path. And also take note that when we pray, God answers our prayer. He said, men are all to pray, not to faint. That is, anybody that is a man, if you have come to the age of accountability, you are now a man, and when Bible say a man, I want you to know that Bible is talking about both men and female. We are all to pray, not to faint. There's something I said in the service yesterday. I want to say it again, that anybody who can pray, anybody is anybody who can pray, that person is higher in the spirit realm than somebody who prophesied prophet who give only prophecy. I say this 
based on scripture. I said it, I gave example. I said, number one, I say Hezekiah, the prophet came to Hezekiah and told Hezekiah, prepare your house, you will die. And Hezekiah said, okay, prophet, I've heard you. And Hezekiah turned to the Lord and gave God reasons that he cannot die. God did not only answer, God added 15 more years to his life. That is number one. It was God who sent the prophet to come and tell him that he will die. But the same God, when he prayed, that is why you are to pray. The prayer of the righteous are violent much. Prayer of righteous makes so much impact. Now, take note of that. I give another example. I said, Jonah, in the belly of fish, cried unto God. Jonah confirmed that God had him even in the belly of fish. He was meant to condemn for disobeying God. God sent him to Nineveh. He was he disobeyed. He was cast and he was swallowed by fish. But right inside the belly of fish, I said on Sunday, that it does not matter the belly of prophecy you are. It can be genuine prophecy from a man of God, from a woman of God. It can be a genuine dream that somebody that is highly gifted I want you to note it again that who, whoever that can pray in the realm of the spirit is stronger than anybody that is gifted with prophecy to see vision, to see future. And Jonah prayed and God had him in the belly of fish. The people of Nineveh sinned and when they heard the word of God, they prayed and God removed what God said he would do unto them. God cancelled it. God changed his mind. I also give another example. I said, when God told, um, I think it was Moses, and said, I'm going to wipe away the people of Israelites. The Bible said Moses intercede. As Moses interceded before God and told God reasons, the Bible said, and God changed his mind. So prayer can even change God's mind. That is why you must take note. Our theme for this month of February is, Oh God, my sustainer. Oh God, my sustainer. And I want you to know that when you talk about sustainer, the Bible says, I slept and woke up because God sustained me. Take note of that. That it is not by your power that you slept. It's not your alarm that woke you up this morning. It is not the noise around that woke you up this morning. It is God's, God's sustenance that woke you up. I want you to know that God gave me this topic last month, January. And so we are going to be praying it this month. Every month, God give me a topic we are going to be praying. That will be our point where we are dwelling. We can now take every other prayer point, but that is our topic. I never know that as day goes by, things began to increase. Right now in the country, right now in the world at large, there, are, there is a lot of increment. People are crying, people are lamenting. Something you buy, if you bought something today, by tomorrow, go back to market, the price has doubled again. But I want you to know this. Despite all that is happening, I'm telling you this. It's not, it's not even just by prophecy, no, but by evidences. We have gone through things in life and we come out of it and we are still standing because the Lord sustains us. I want you to know that you are going to pass through this season, pass through these challenges, pass through this difficult time, pass through this hard time, but you will, you will come out strong. You know why? Because the Lord has promised to sustain you. Financially, God has promised to sustain you. I say this again. No matter the economy of the jungle, the lion cannot eat grass. No. When you see a lion eating a grass, then you know that something is wrong. It's not it's just something is terribly bad. 
no matter the economy of the country, no matter the difficulties in the world, I want you to know that you and I will be sustained by God. When Bible say I slept and woke up because God sustained me, that is why you must know that for you to do anything in this season and get out of it, become you know come out strong is because of mighty hand of God that sustain you. And we're going to be praying in that order. Father, sustain me. The Bible says, when men say there is casting down, those that God sustain will say there is lifting up. When God sustain you, you will never know scarcity, even in the midst of scarcity. You will never know scarcity, even in the midst of scarcity. The Bible told us that there was a farmer in the land and God spoke to Elijah and said, after he ran away from Jezebel, after God fed him with a bed, and God said, told him, rise up now and journey. You will get a city. You will see a widow, a widow and her son, who have their last meal to eat and die because there is famine in the land. Maybe right where you are hearing me now, there is famine in the land. Wherever you are, it's no longer a news. Even a little child knows that there is famine in the land. Anything happening in this world has already happened before in the Bible. And God told Elijah, meet the woman, collect the food, eat, because God wants to sustain the woman. And the Bible told us that Elijah went to the woman, prepare for me first. And the woman did as the man of God instructed her. And in the Bible say, the food multiply. Remember what the woman said. He said, man of God, this is the last meal I have to eat and die with my child. But he said, give me first. Because we don't live by economy of the world. We live by economy of heaven. Because it is not of him that we let. It is of God that sustains. It's of God that sustains. It is not of him that hustle. Yes, it is good to hustle. It is good to go to school and learn. It is good to go to shop, have business. It is good to plan. It is good to make effort. It is good to open a shop. It is good to get a job, to go to work. But I want you to know, it is a law that sustains. Not of him that run it, not of him that hustle it, not of him that hustle it, not of him that is wise, not of him that know how to read and write. It is of the law that sustain. Men and brethren, once the sustenance of God is upon you, you will never go dry. And I declare right where you are now, that in the name of Jesus, starting from this week, you will begin to experience the mighty hand of God for sustenance in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. As, I'm, as I'm speaking like this, as, I, as I'm speaking like this, as I close my eyes, I saw a bright light, like a light that just shined and the door just got open. I don't know what that means, but I know it is good. I know that God is shining his light of sustenance upon somebody. I am speaking into your life that this week, starting from this week, I repeat, it does not matter how much dollar is. Like I told people, as long as you play your part, not just play your part, play your part well. Play your part well. Some time ago, somebody said, I don't want to go to school again. I don't want to go to school. I said, why? He said, nah, nah, nah. this one happened. I said, no. I said, God will bless you, but you need to get what you need to get. You doing what you are meant to do, we open door. We make it easier for God's blessing. But the truth is this. Ask any person that is on the top, any great man, any great woman, great man in the, in the ministry, great man in the business world, great man in industry, great man in career. Ask any great person. They will let you know that it's not all about their effort. 
it's not all about all. All is not all about God is the one that blesses our effort and turn it for our blessing. So God is the one that sustains. Businessmen and women, God is the one that sustains. You are going to pray that prayer very well. I, I'm speaking because I want you to understand it. Father, sustain me. In a time like this, Lord, sustain me. In a time like this where they say dollar is high, sustain me. We are going to pray that prayer, but before we do that, I want you to share the link now. Type it on your social media platform. God is my sustainer. God is my sustainer. God is my sustainer. It doesn't matter how much is dollar. God is my sustainer. It doesn't matter what is going on around me. God is my sustainer. God is my sustainer. Type it. God is my sustainer. Type it right there. God my sustainer. Type it right now. Type it right now. If you are with me wherever you are, if you are connected with me wherever you are, type it, type it, share the link. Share the link. Tell somebody, let us pray. We chin on say neighbor because God is our sustainer. Without God, you can do nothing. Without God, you can do nothing. He said, He said, lean not unto your own understanding. He said, In all your ways, acknowledge him. And he will do what? He will direct your path. He is your sustainer. Share the link right now. Share the link right now. Share the link now. Type it. I want to see you typing it. I want to see you typing it. God is my sustainer. God is my sustainer. Type it. Type it. Type it. Everybody, wherever you are, type it before we begin to pray. God is my sustainer. God is my sustainer. I will not be stranded. God is my sustainer. I will not be frustrated. God is my sustainer. I will not see shame this year. God is my sustainer. I will not be stranded. God is my sustainer. When men say they are casting down, I will say they are rising up because God is my sustainer. When people open their business and they are not selling, I will open and sell because God is my sustainer. When they are decreasing salary of others because of economy, my own will be increased because God is my sustainer. There was a farmer, but the Bible says, and Isaac sowed in that land the same year and he caught hundred folds. The Bible says, until the Egyptians, I mean the Philistines, until the Philistines envied him. It is possible not to feel bad market when people are saying there is bad market. It is possible. It is possible. Share the link. We are going to begin to pray. Father, in this season, I hand my life over to you. Lord, sustain me. Before we pray that prayer, we're going to say, Father, thank you for all these years of your sustenance in my life. For all this year, you have sustained me. You have seen me through, through tough time, through tough period. You brought me. I'm still standing. Lord, thank you. Can we pray that prayer now? Can we thank him for all the years he has sustained us? For all the years he has sustained us. For all the years he has sustained us. If you have ever experienced the sustenance of God, can you thank him? Can you thank him? Can you thank him, please? Can you join me to say, Lord, thank you for sustaining me. Thank you for sustaining me. Father, I thank you. In my ministry, Lord, I have seen your sustenance power. Lord, thank you for sustaining us, Lord. We worship you. We give you all the glory, Lord. We give you all the honor, Lord. We give you all the adoration, Lord. For your mighty hand of sustenance. For your mighty hand of sustenance. For your mighty hand of sustenance. Financially, you sustain us. Father, thank you. Financially, we are sustained. Spiritually, we are sustained. Lord, you sustain my health. I worship you. I thank you, Lord. I am not taking it for granted. I enjoy your mighty hand of sustenance. Thank all the glory, Lord. Take all the honor. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. You are going to say, Father, in a time like this, I had my life and my face 
into your hand. Lord, sustain me. I had my political career sustain me. I had my business career sustain me. I had everything that concerns me, my ministry, my education, my career, my job, everything, this business I'm doing, I hand it over to you. Lord, sustain me. I had my family. I had my children. In a time like this, we are there is uncertainty in the world. Security uncertainty. Lord, sustain me. Sustain my family. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Very serious prayer point. Lord, sustain us. Lord, I had my ministry. Over to you, Lord. I had the Elijah Faith Assembly. Over to you, Lord. Sustain us, Lord. Sustain us, Lord. Sustain us, Lord. In a time like this, oh God. In a scarcity time like this, Lord. In a difficult time like this, Lord. We pray for your sustenance. We pray that you sustain us. We pray that you sustain us. Even in this moment of increment of that dollars, it sustain us, Lord. Sustain us, Lord. We pray for your sustenance in our life, in our destiny. We pray for your sustenance in the name of Jesus. Sustain my family. Sustain my children. Sustain my household. Sustain my parents. Sustain my family members. Sustain my siblings in the name of Jesus. Lord, I pray for your mighty hand to sustain us in the morning, sustain us in the afternoon, sustain us in the night, sustain us in the evening, sustain us. Lord, I surrender. Lord, I surrender. Lord, I surrender. Lord, I hand our life over to you. Sustain us, Lord. 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 Keep us going. Keep us moving. Keep us going. Keep us moving. Keep us going. Keep us moving. Father, sustain me. Father, sustain me. When others are falling, Lord, sustain me. Do not let me fall. When others are falling, Lord, Lord, sustain me in a wicked world like this. Sustain us, Lord. In a wicked world like this, sustain your people. In a period like this, sustain your people. Lord, I pray for everyone connected online right now. I am praying for your children connected online. Lord God of mercy, release your hand of sustenance upon them. I pray for businessmen and women. Lord, sustain them. I pray for businessmen and women. Lord, sustain them. Lord, sustain them. I pray for career people. Lord, sustain them. I pray for students. Lord, sustain them. Upon everyone connected online right now. Father, sustain them. 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 Lord, sustain your people. 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 Lord, sustain your people in a time like this that the whole world is shaking financially. Lord, sustain your people. Jehovah, we pray for your sustenance power. 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 Lord, 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 in our going out, in our coming in, Lord, sustain your children. 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 For whatever is committed in your hand is saved and say God. Sustain your people. Sustain your people. Sustain your people. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. I hope you are praying that prayer well where you are. I hope you are praying that prayer well. The reason why I talk sometimes before we pray is because I want you to truly understand that what the meaning of the prayer point or the prayer point we are praying, I want you to understand it. You must know that without God, you are nothing. You are nothing. Without God, you are nothing. So you must take these prayers serious. If you are just joining online now, I want you to type it very bold. 
God is my sustainer. Type it very, very bold. Type it very bold. God, my sustainer. God is my sustainer. Type it well. Type it well. If you are just hearing me, even if you have done it before, do it again. Lord is my sustainer. Lord is my sustainer. Say it. You don't need to stop saying it. Lord is my sustainer. In the morning, in the afternoon, the Lord is my sustainer. You are going to pray. Every enemy of my sustenance. Every enemy that say God will not sustain me, that I will not enjoy the sustenance power of God. Let that enemy, there is enemy of health. There is enemy of our well-being. There is enemy of finance. They call some enemy of progress. There is enemy of your up, going up, your upliftment. There is enemy of your upliftment. There is enemy of your turnaround. You are going to pray. Every enemy of my sustenance, let the fire of God destroy. Every enemy opposing and saying that I will not be sustained by God, even in a dry time like this, let that enemy be destroyed. Every enemy of my sustenance be destroyed by fire. We are going to shout it, fire of God once. You call your name and pray. Fire of God once, shall we go? The fire of God. Chin on so favor and able. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Begin to pray that prayer. Begin to pray that prayer. Begin to pray that prayer. Every enemy of my sustenance. Every enemy of my sustenance. Every enemy of my sustenance. Be destroyed. Be destroyed. Be destroyed. Be destroyed. Be destroyed. Be destroyed. By fire. By fire. By fire. By fire. By fire. By fire. By fire, by fire, by fire, by fire, by fire. Lord, 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 every enemy that say that I will not enjoy the sustenance power of God, let that enemy be destroyed. Be destroyed, be destroyed by fire, 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 by fire. Fire, by 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 fire, every power saying that we not enjoy the sustenance power of God, that I will not enjoy the grace of sustenance of God, that I will not enjoy the grace of God for sustenance. Let our power be destroyed. Every enemy that is against my sustenance, that is against my sustenance, let the enemy be destroyed. 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 Every enemy that is saying no to my sustenance, be destroyed. Be destroyed. Be destroyed. Be destroyed. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Fire. Let us repeat our prayer. Every enemy saying that I will not be sustained financially. I will not be sustained physically. I will not be sustained in my health. I want you to know that it is God that giveth divine health. It is God that giveth divine health. Every enemy of my divine health, every enemy of my sustenance, health wise, every enemy of my financial sustenance, every enemy that say my marriage will not be sustained, every enemy that say my career will not be sustained, every enemy that say I will not be sustained financially, let the enemy be destroyed. You are going to shout fire of God one more time. You call your name begin to destroy that enemy take it around, take it around all your expectation, let the, let the enemy that say that your expectation will not come through let that enemy be destroyed we shall fire of God once, we take that prayer shall we go open your mouth, open your mouth open your mouth, open your mouth open your mouth open your mouth, 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 open your mouth, open your mouth Every enemy of my ministry sustenance, we destroy, 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 we destroy. Oh God, my Lord. Oh God, my sustainer. 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 
so stand me, O God. I shall pray. Every enemy of my sustenance be destroyed. Be destroyed. Be destroyed. Be destroyed. Let the enemy of my sustenance be destroyed. Let the enemy of my sustenance be destroyed. Let the enemy fighting my sustenance be destroyed. By fire. 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 I come against you by fire. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Fire. Which area of your life do you want God to sustain you? I know that every one of you, you have a major area. You want God to sustain so Somebody connected online right now. Your mother is sick. Your mother is sick. Your mother is sick. Right at the hospital. Your mother is sick. I'm seeing a woman that is sick and they have marked death upon her. But I want to tell you in the name of Jesus, the mighty hand of God will sustain that woman. Amen. The mighty hand of God will sustain that woman. Amen. Anybody connected right now that your mother, your father, any member of your family is sick, I declare that the mighty hand of God will proceed forth now to sustain that mother, that father right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. I say that sickness will not kill that your mother. Amen. I don't know who I'm talking to. 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 The mighty hand of God will sustain that woman in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Which area of your life do you want God to sustain you? Financially, you want God to sustain you. Physically, maritally, which area? You are going to tell it to God and say, Father, in this area of my life, sustain me, sustain me, sustain me, sustain me financially, sustain me spiritually, ministerially, sustain me. We shout in the name of Jesus once, you call your name and pray. In the name of Jesus once, shall we go? In the name of Jesus. Jesus, so fair for an able. Father, I come before you and I ask you, God, sustain my health. Sustain my, sustain my ministry, sustain my ministry, sustain my ministry, sustain the Elijah Faith Assembly, sustain my health, oh God, sustain me financially, oh God, my sustainer, oh God, my sustainer. Oh God, my sustainer. Oh God, my sustainer. Sustain my ministry. Oh God, my sustainer. Sustain my health. Oh God, my sustainer. Sustain my finance. Oh God, my sustainer. Sustain me in a time like this. Sustain me, Lord. In a time like this. Sustain me, Lord. In a time like this. Sustain me, Lord. In this difficult time. Lord. Lord, 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 sustain a larger faith assembly. Sustain, let us pray, prayer platform. Sustain the members of let us pray, prayer platform. Sustain every member of let us pray, prayer platform. Sustain every member of let us pray, prayer platform. Wherever they are right now, Father, sustain them. As many connected online now, Lord, sustain them. Financially, Lord sustain them in their health, Lord sustain them in their career, Lord sustain them in their ministry, Lord sustain them, 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 mighty hand of God, sustain them, mighty hand of God, sustain them, mighty hand of God, sustain every member of let us pray prayer platform, mighty hand of God. God, sustain them. Every member of this platform, Lord, sustain them. Mighty hand of God, sustain every member of this platform. Everyone that is connected to this platform, Lord, sustain them. Lord, sustain them. Lord, sustain them. Everybody connected this online now, Father, sustain them. I prophesy your sustainer's power, your sustainer's power, your sustainer's power. Your sustenance power, your sustenance power, your sustenance power, your sustenance power. come upon them. 
Your sustenance power, come upon them. Your sustenance power, come upon them. Your sustenance power, come upon them. Jehovah, sustain your people. 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 Sustain their health. 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 Sustain their marriage. Sustain their business. Sustain their finance. Sustain their ministry. Sustain their career. I pray, O God, for your mighty hand of sustenance to rest upon them. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Wherever you are, in the name of Jesus, I decree every member of this platform, I am praying for you. I pray for you in every of time of my prayer, but I'm praying for you now as you can hear me. I am not saying members of Elijah Faith Assembly. No, I'm saying members of Let Us Pray Prayer Platform. I am praying for you right now. Wherever you are, those of you connecting to this prayer platform from outside Nigeria, those of you that is in Nigeria here, I am praying for you now. I am praying for you concerning your business. Those of you into business, I am praying for you concerning your job, concerning your work. Those of you working in any company, in any organization, I am praying for all the career people that are members of Let Us Pray Prayer Platform. I am praying for all the businessmen and women. I am praying for all the students that are members of this pla platform. That in the name of Jesus, wherever you are, let the mighty hand of God for sustenance come upon you in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. I am praying for you from the best heart of mine, from the heart of love. I pray for you out of love. I pray for every member of this platform from the heart of love that in the name of Jesus, in this period of time, in a world like this, in a time of scarcity like this, in a time where things are increased, where things are very expensive, where things are very high, I declare that the mighty hand of God for sustenance come upon you, 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 come upon your business, come upon your business, come upon your business, come upon your career, come upon your job, come upon your finance, come upon your finance, come upon your marriage, come upon your ministry, come upon your life, come upon your children, upon your family, upon your family, upon your family, upon your source, upon your source 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 in the name of Jesus Christ the Bible told us the story of people of Israelite why they were in Egypt the Bible said that that night the Lord will pass through the land and all the firstborn will die both men both human and animal he said, but even if you are in this Egypt, kill a ram or an animal, kill a lamb, and carry the blood put at the lintel of your door. You are in Egypt too, but there is a covenant on your head. You are in Egypt too, you are in the same land with others. You are in the same city with others. You are in the same place with everybody. But there is different. There is a mark on your household. That is what I'm praying for. Every member. Listen to me again. Now I'm not speaking to members of Elijah Faith Assembly. I don't know why I'm saying this again and again. I'm praying for every member of this Let Us Pray prayer platform. That despite you are in this world. Despite you are in Nigeria, for those of you in Nigeria or in any part of the world, I am putting a mark in the realm of the spirit upon your forehead now. And I want you to be in the spirit and I want you to hear me. 
It does not matter the prophecy that have come forth for this year. It does not matter the prophecy, the, 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 the evil words, the plans of the government or the plans of the increment. But I want you to know, like the Bible says, that God told the people of Israelite, you are in Egypt, hunger will pass. Oh. You are in Egypt, death will pass. You are in Egypt, sorrow will pass. You are in Egypt, some people will be crying. But I am putting a mark of the covenant on your head. That even if others are crying, that you will not cry. That was the symbol of the blood of Jesus Christ upon the lintel of that door. I am putting a mark on your forehead wherever you are right now. I am putting a mark on your forehead right now in the spirit realm. I am putting a mark on your forehead like this. A mark of cross on your forehead. A mark of sustenance on your forehead. A mark of sustenance on your forehead. Everyone hearing me right now. Everyone connected right now. Upon you, upon your family, upon your family, upon your business, upon your life, I put a mark. Upon your finance, I put a mark of divine sustenance. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Type amen. Type amen, type amen. The mark is not what you can see with physical eyes. For as many my father has put into my hand, no power is able to pluck them out of my hand. You are connected. I am entering into a covenant with every one of you. I am establishing a covenant with every one of you. I am establishing a covenant with every one of you. I am establishing a covenant for every one of you. Covenant of sustenance. 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 Those of you saying amen. Amen. You are entering into that covenant. Amen. Whenever you are saying amen, you are entering into that covenant. Amen. Whenever you are type amen, you are entering into that covenant. Amen. Whenever you are type amen, whenever you are type amen, amen. whenever you are say amen. amen, whenever you are type amen, amen. whenever you are say amen, amen. you are entering into that covenant. Amen. Covenant of sustenance, amen. covenant of divine 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 sustenance. Amen. I bring you to that covenant amen. of divine sustenance. Amen. I bring into that covenant Amen. of divine sustenance. Amen. Your health will be sustained. Amen. Your finance will be sustained. Amen. Your marriage will be sustained. Amen. Your children will be sustained. Amen. Your career will be sustained. Amen. Your business will be sustained. Amen. Your traveling will be sustained. Amen. Your visa will be sustained. Amen. Your career will be sustained. Amen. Your life will be sustained. Amen. Your life will be sustained. Amen. Your life will be sustained. Amen. Your health will be sustained. Amen. Your health will be sustained. Amen. Your health will be sustained. Amen. Your ministry will be sustained. Amen. Your ministry will be sustained. Amen. Your conception. Sustain Amen. your conception, sustain Amen. your expectation, sustain Amen. your expectation, sustain Amen. your expectation, sustain Amen. in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Type it. I enter into covenant of divine sustenance. 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 I want to type it. Type it, type it, type it. I enter into covenant of divine sustenance. When you're on the air, God will sustain you. When you're on the land, God will sustain you. When you are traveling, God will sustain you. When you are traveling, God will sustain you. It doesn't matter kidnappers on the way. It doesn't matter people diverting cars, diverting buses. It doesn't matter prepared accident. But I declare God will sustain you. God will sustain you. Your life will be sustained. Your life will be sustained. Type it, type it. Type it by type it through mouth. You enter into confession. Your confession is made through mouth. Your confession will be established. Confess it. Type it. I want to see you. Type it. Type it. Type it in our live chat now. Type it in our live chat now. I enter into covenant of divine sustenance. I enter into covenant of divine sustenance. Type it now. Type it now. Send it to somebody. Type it. Put it on your social media platform. I enter into covenant of divine sustenance. This week is your week of divine sustenance. This week is your week of divine sustenance. This week is your week of divine sustenance. Week of divine sustenance. In the morning, God will sustain you. In the afternoon, God will sustain you. In the night, God will sustain you. Wherever you are, God will sustain you. Wherever you are, God will sustain you. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. It is my week of divine sustenance. 
It is my week of divine sustenance. It is my week of divine sustenance. It is my week of divine sustenance. It is my week of divine sustenance. The Lord will sustain you. Hear me correctly. I don't know what is happening around you. But here today, by the reason, everybody, do this on your forehead. Do a sign of cross on your forehead. Do it. You may look foolishly. Just do it. You will not understand. Just do it. A sign of cross on your forehead. A sign of cross on your forehead. If you have your children around, just do it. If you have oil, if you have anointing oil with you, you can just use the anointing oil. Do it. You can use the anointing oil. Do it. That sign is establishment of covenant that the mighty hand of God for divine sustenance will come on you. We come on your business. Amen. We come on your family. Amen. Hear me. I quote scripture. In Israel, there was katakata. Death passed. But those people that the sign of blood is on their head, they were preserved. They were preserved. I want you to know this. Whatever it is going on, I say this again. You will enjoy divine sustenance in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Whatever happening in this world, I say it again. You will enjoy divine sustenance in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Every one of you that is sick now with any pains, I am angry with sickness this year and I'm going to be dealing with them by the grace of God with anger. Any one of you sick hearing me now, any pain, any pain, any pain, any evil pen, any demonic pen in your body. You went to bed, you were okay. But when you wake up, you woke up with pens. Any pen from the crown of your head to the sole of your feet. Any pens, any sickness in your organ. Any sickness from the crown of your head to the sole of your feet. Right where you are. Place your hand where you're having that pen. Place your hand where you're having that pen. Place your hand anywhere you're feeling pain. I am enjoying the grace of God for sustenance. And I come to you with that grace. And I command every pen in your body right now. Disappear in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Everyone watching, I lay my hand on your head. He said, no, so you shall lay hand on the sick. And the sick shall recover anywhere you are. In the name of Jesus, I lay hand upon you and I declare healing, healing, Amen. 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 healing. Amen. in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Infirmity, diseases disappear. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ, I declare you healed. I declare you free. Amen. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Amen. Remember, I enter into covenant of divine sustenance. The Lord divinely will sustain you this week. Amen. The Lord divinely will sustain you this week. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. We continue our prayers on divine sustenance. Next week, Monday. Remember, this platform is every Monday, 6 a.m. Please learn to join on time so that you don't miss any part of the prayers. And the Lord will keep sustaining you Amen. in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. You will not go hungry. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. God bless you. I want to drop an offering for your sustenance. Seed of sustenance. So a seed. Let it not just be an offering. Let it be a seed. The account number is going to be displayed right now on the screen. So a seed of sustenance. Like I told you, I hate sickness this year. I am angry. War. I am in war with sickness this year. I don't want sickness. And I don't want it for myself. I don't want it for any of you. Join me on one day healing and deliverance service where I will be laying hand upon everybody. War against sickness. War against infirmity. And the Lord will bless you as you do. Take time. Please send your offering right now. Send your offering right now. Send your offering right now. Offering of divine sustenance, and as you drop this seed of divine sustenance, the Lord will sustain you in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. God bless you. Your week is blessed, your week is favored, your week is full of divine sustenance. You will not be stranded, or you will not be frustrated, and you will not see shame this week. I bless you 
in the name of Jesus Christ. Mm -hmm. I bless your week in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. I bless your going out and coming in in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. This week, no bad phone call. You will not receive, you will not call. Amen. You will not receive, you will not call. Amen. Bad phone call, you will not receive, you will not call. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. God bless you. We have come to the end of our prayers today, Monday. I will see you next week, Monday. Remain blessed and remain focused and always remember that if it is God, Surely it will always be God. Shalom and God bless you. Grace is found. Grace saved me. Grace made me who I am. Grace redeemed me. Grace sustains me. Grace made me. this cause the Lord is going to break now. Amen. The cause that say you people will not enjoy marriage. Amen. This Anoluwa got married, had children, but suddenly separated from the husband. Now she's struggling alone. Say after me, say me better. Come on, come radical. The angel that came now, I saw some of the angels holding cutlass. It's a radical spirit. Something will happen now. Something will happen now. Some uncle will die now. We want to. Since your father was small. His people have hated him. The only child. They hated him. There is this cause the Lord is going to break now. Amen. The cause that say you people will not enjoy marriage. This Anoluwa got married, had children. Was suddenly separated from the husband. Now she's struggling alone. Say after me, say any Come on, come radical. The angel.